Today we're here installing a one lift pump station for wastewater utilities, shipped to site day of and dropped into place all within uh, one workday. Start to finish with a cast in place construction of this size would probably be about six weeks. That's a lot of labor and a lot of time and also you have a hole open for a long time. When you're talking about putting a pump station in the ground in a day, you're done in a day. If you're talking about having people uh, up and down ladders, lifting things over their heads, drilling, cutting in the field for, for weeks at a time, it's of course there's more of a chance to get injured. This definitely shortened up the time frame that a normal job like this would take and we were able to do the job in a much safer way, being more accurate and being more efficient. I was very comfortable uh, for the safety of my men and for myself and even uh, the overlookers watching on site. So I was very happy with the process. We are building it completely before it goes out to the job site. That means assembling all the pipes, the valves, the ladders, the hatches. Everything is put together in the factory 100% before it even goes out to the job site. Everything is constructed in a controlled environment. So when it comes out here, there is no movement because it's already been put together and you're basically putting it in the hole. The conventional pump station is two structures. You've got a valve vault and you've got a wet well. What we're doing is putting these two together to make it a smaller structure and make it an easier, safer installation for the contractor. It also adds avoiding the differential settlement between the wet well and then the valve vault. Those two structures, they're gonna settle different, but you have that one pipe running between them that is gonna have to make up for that settling. And that can and has led to many issues in the past. With the one lift, we, we don't have those issues. We've really tried to standardize our pump stations. And in using Old Castle, we were able to use the same pumps that we use in the other pump stations and the same control panels. So for my staff, when they come in, they may see a different hatch assembly, but all the equipment, all the pumps, all the controls are all gonna be the same, and we were able to do it in a lot less time. That was a big one for us. What I really love about the one lift pump station is it allows the manufacturer to work with other manufacturers and integrate other products within the one lift solution. It's very customizable beyond what is typical. And if uh, it hasn't been done before, we can always do it in the future. This station that's being installed uh, just happens to be a four-piece station. It's got a base, it's a ring section, it's got a valve vault, and then it's got a cover. Uh, those can be two sections, just very short. It can go up to 26 to 30 feet, so you're talking about maybe six or seven sections tall. It all depends on what the customer needs, what's required for the site. With this particular pump station, we have different sizes, and the one that's being installed today is the RC1016, and that will uh, take much larger uh, pipe sizes. What we're about to see is the third ring going in. It has all of the main components that are included in a valve vault, so you'll have piping and valves and couplings, and this has actually got the valve vault in it. It's probably the most complex part of the pump station. Now, as you can see, the site here is very tight, and we have a protected wetland behind us. Between the sheeting system that we used and being able to use the Old Castle system, we were able to basically dig a cylinder, and actually, within a day, we were able to get the wet well four sections in, and now we're backfilling. So not only is the One Lift a great solution for our customer as far as the infrastructure, it allows us to provide a complete package from design to finish. One stop, one solution. They get the pump station, they get the pumps, they get the controls, and they get the support for years to come. I think this could be the new innovative way to make these pump stations work. I look forward to using this system again.